Chastity belt. Jeff Jeff asked you maybe if a, a chastity belt would, would help out, and um, it, indeed that uh, that well that's what you did, right? Well, yes, yes, I did. I took that uh, that recommendation to heart, and mm-hmm. my ball welded me up a uh, chastity belt. And, uh, everything was looking pretty good. I mean, uh, Obama came and slashed me in his rape van, and I told him, hey, now, Obama, you can't rape me. I'm going to have a right. chassis belt. I'm going to have a chassis belt. That friggin' Obama always yeah. trying to rape you. He's a sick man. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you. But... Oh, no, oh. no. Yeah, he is a sick man. He's a sick man. He really is. But I'm sorry. So so he showed up in the, in the rape van. Obama did. And you had the chastity belt on. Yes, I had the chastity belt on. Uh, he, he saw that I had the chastity belt. He was a little surprised. I, I don't think he expected it. But mm. uh, he, uh, when he invited me to dinner, which was kind of odd, I, I wasn't sure about that little angle he was doing. But I figured, hey, a free meal, you know, uh, that, that sounds like, uh, like fun. And, I mean, he kind of owes me a free meal after... All the times he's raped me, so mm. well, I figured I'd go, I'd go, you know, eat a meal with him, and then the son of a bitch slipped me a roofie. Oh, oh. man, he he slipped me a roofie. That's horrible. Sick, sick bastard. Unreal. It's it's so, just messed up. Was he able to was he able to get the chastity belt off after he slipped you the? Or do you know? Do you remember? Well, I, I don't remember. I woke up and Ron Paul was there. And, mm-hmm. and he, told me, he told me that the cast of the belt survived him and, and did its job. So I was pretty happy. Good. It seemed to have done the job. Oh, so, so, Conrad, so he was... So Obama was actually unable to penetrate you. He was unable to rape you. He was unable, yes, with the, uh, the trash the belt. He was very strong. I'm always willing to go out of some of the strongest men of our earth. And, and uh, it did, it did ha- hold up. That, so, uh, oh, I mean, that's just wonderful news. I'm really excited about this. I haven't, I haven't okay. been able to, I haven't been able to watch the clip yet. I haven't been able to watch the show yet. So you're, you're telling me firsthand. I, I haven't been able to catch up yet. Um, well, that I, well, that's great news that Obama was unable to rape you because of the the chastity belt. Then. And so the the um, the rocket dildos were unable to penetrate. Did he did he try the rocket dildo? Well, I haven't seen any rocket dildos yet now, so okay. Well, we'll have to see how the how the chastity belt holds up to them. But mm-hmm. uh, there is one. One little downside to the chastity belt, and John McCain mm. made use of that. 
Yeah. That was unfortunate. Yes. John McCain is scary. He's a scary guy. Oh, he's very scary. He does some little thing with his mouth. I don't. He's very scary. I don't like him. Mm. I don't like him one bit. No, no, I can't imagine you do. Well, oh, John McCain. I thought the chassis belt was working uh, like gangbusters. You know, you just just defeated Obama, and then all of a sudden there's a loophole, and oh my goodness, I, I don't know what to do, guys. It's one thing or another, I can't stop it. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. what's going on with uh, Diane Feinstein? She just came to. She just seems to keep coming back to life. I mean, are they cloning her? Do they have like an army of these? I was wondering that too. Feinstein, yeah. I mean, she's kind of scary. I mean, not as scary as McCain, but I mean, she's scary. Well, she's terrifying. She's terrifying. She doesn't die like you say. I mean. Well, Paul's killed her like seven different ways. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's just coming back. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ran over her with a tank. Yeah. Blew her up once or twice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Wow. She just yeah. keeps coming. I don't understand. She's ruthless, persistent. You can, <laughs> you can tell she's dead just by looking at her. <clears throat> she may be. Maybe they're uh, using yeah, some sort of, like, sorcery or something. Now, Feinstein, she's raped you as well, hasn't she, Conrad? Oh, just about everybody. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she has, yeah. It's, 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 yeah. She scares me, guys. She terrifies me. Uh, I don't know She won't die. I don't, I don't get it. It's coming back. When I least expect it, too. When I least expect it, there she is. She pops up. So, have you, back to the chastity belt, have you been wearing this constantly now? I mean, just because of that? Because of when you, you know, like you said, when you least expect it, these sick bastards come and, and try to penetrate you and, and rape you? Yeah, well, you know, I have been, but it's not very comfortable, I admit it. It doesn't feel so good. Uh, no, I, sure, but it's got to be better than being raped, r- raped in the ass. No, I'm pretty sure I'm not pretty used to it. So. Mhm, mhm. Just... I understand. You have been being raped for a, a, a very extensive amount of time. So. Yeah, after a while, you just kind of get used to it. <laughs> No one yeah. should ever get used to something like that. No one. But it's just, you know, Jeff, like he's, like he's, Conrad said, it's daily, right, Conrad? I mean, it's just, this is just something you always have constantly looking out for, for hundreds of years. Hmm. That's right. Well, well, it's just bad. It's you're, not so, you're so, you're such a brave little constitution to, you know, cut, come out and, you know, tell us your story and let the world know. I don't know how you what, do what it. these What these people do to you. No, well, I have, the, I have the utmost respect. Well, Con- Conrad, uh, this is Chris. I, I do have a question for you. Um, seeing, seeing, how you're, seeing how you're so close with uh, Ron Paul, uh, what do you think about his son? Because... Uh, I mean, is he has he been taking any part mm. in the uh, in the rapist at all? Because uh, oh. uh, I'm I'm definitely uh, I'm definitely uh, I definitely would like to hear about that because uh, you know Man. they're they're definitely uh, two different people. So uh, what's your what's your relationship with Rand? Well, I haven't seen Rand too much. Well, I only hang out with Ron most of the time. You know, we've been here from time to time. I've uh, talked with him. Mm-hmm. You know. Now, has he ever tried to um, touch you in any inappropriate ways? Or <laughs> or maybe, you know, has he tried to rape you? Mr. Rand Paul? Mr. Rand, Mr. Rand, Rand Paul, Rand, yeah. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I've had a little, a little feeling, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh, but he's never actually done anything, you know, in 
a couple of years, okay. I get a, get a little feeling, uh, you know. Yeah. Like an old feeling. Is he giving you those? Is he, is he giving you those eyes? Does you do you get those eyes when you see him? The right, the right the eyes. Is that what yeah. The right eyes? Yeah, the right mm. eyes. <laughs> yeah, I, I see a little, little right the eyes, and it, it makes me a little concerned. Mm-hmm. That, you know, uh, well, I hope he wouldn't do anything. I mean, Ron is my my best friend. It'd be kind of weird. <laughs> Yeah, I agree. I agree. That's what. That's why I asked you because you know I thought I didn't know if that would uh, you know affect anything. So I thought it was a pretty well, legit, legit you know, question. Put a little, put a little strain on our relationship. That's for sure. Yeah, mm. I, I bet. Mm, the, 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 it's gonna put. It would have to put um, Ron in a real tough position because I know I know how much Ron cares for you. You know that's legit. Definitely would put him in an awkward position. That is, that is it, it, it would. It, it really would. So, because like I said, it, it's legit. Ron really does care for you, and um, you can tell. You you can tell. You like when you look in his eyes, he doesn't have the rape. You know, the I want to rape you eyes. You know. No, so definitely then, not. I, definitely not. Definitely not. He cares about you, and, and it was just good. And um, but I, I'm I am with Chris. I am concerned about um, Rand. And um, you know, just watch it. Watch your back. That's all. Mm-hmm. You know. Literally. Which, yeah. Right. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'll, I'll watch my back. <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 I know that the last time you called in, we did briefly talk about. Um, Maybe ways that we could help you from um, being raped less and, um, you know, less molestation. Um, I guess, uh, you know, have, is there anything more at this point? Have you thought about anything more that we could possibly do for you other than just spreading the word of, you know, what Obama and, and Holder and, and, um, you know all these other other people that you know that rape you. Well, yeah. I wish I had a solution. Uh, mm. You know, mm-hmm. just put the word, and let everybody know what's happening to me, and maybe if enough people get a little little concerned for a minute, and, you know, maybe maybe they'll stop these guys. Well, yeah, maybe go. I, I know what the solution is. It, it, the Conrad, the Constitution, is the solution. So right. Okay. Okay, but we got to get him start to to stop being raped, though. We're trying. We're trying, Conrad. We got your back. We're doing. Mm-hmm. What we're doing. Yeah, my back in a good way. That's good. In, in a good way. In right. a good way. That's right. Okay. That's right. None of us, none of us want to rape you, Conrad. We want to see you stopped being raped by Obama, and um, you know, let, let's face it, Bush and and everybody else that's been raping you for all for all these years. We want to put an end to it for good. We really, really do. We're on your side. Well, I'm definitely like that. I I can tell you what. I... I don't know if I could even imagine a world like that after all these years. And that's the sad well, part. Could you could you imagine start uh, uh, again? Uh, yeah, like you said, after all these years having, you know, stopped being stopped being raped, your um your your butthole would probably start feeling better. Um, you know, physically and emotionally. I, I just can imagine, you know. The healing process could start. Right, and that's the important part. Yes, that is. That is no one. We live in a world where people get raped, and it's not good. And especially when our favorite, favorite little guy, the Constitution, and that's not cool. And that's, and if the Constitution, if they get away with raping the Constitution, then we're all going to get raped, and that's that's we cannot let that happen. No, that's right. When they rape me, they rape all of you. Right, right, right. Oh, absolutely. Oh, absolutely. If they they have no problems raping us, I mean, you're 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 calling out the Constitution. 
you should be protected at all means. And they, you know, they have your way with you. What's wrong? We know. We know. And, and um, you know, it just, it affects, it affects all of us. Yeah. Your, your body, your bodyguard Ron is doing doing a real real good job, but uh, He's it's, trying. Going to, it's going to take more than just one person, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, it is. You have Alex. You have Alex. You know, Alex Jones does what he he can as well. But um, do you, Conrad? Can you see anyone in the future being able to uh, you know step in and help you out a little bit? I'm hoping there's some people out there who can listen to right now. Maybe they could step in and help them out. And in turn, yeah. they would help everyone else out. Because without me... That's the one that's right. <coughs> no, that's right, Conrad. Absolutely. So, well, Conrad... <clears throat> Excuse me. We really, again, we really do appreciate you calling in and, uh, you know, giving us the lowdown on what's going on and uh, the scoop on the chastity belt. I'm glad that I'm glad that worked out for you. We'll, uh, we'll t- let everybody know where where they can um, where they can find the uh, the episodes of what's going on. All right, Jim. Go ahead and give them your your YouTube. YouTube channel. You ever want to watch my story? You know, you can just Google Conrad the Constitution, or you can go to YouTube and, and search my name, Conrad the Constitution, mm-hmm. and all my videos will pop right up. And you can watch uh, the tale of my life. And it's uh, it's scary at times, it's exciting at times, and it's, it's funny at times. And, and it's happy at times, so, you know, there's a little bit of every emotion in there, and, uh... Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, well, you, you, you get a little bit of everything, so... Well, I mean, it's your life, but... You know, we, we, we go tell everybody that, you know, it is it is for, um, you know, mature audiences, because this is real life. This isn't, you know, this isn't a joke, or... You know, okay. anything like that. You you actually do get, you know, physically molested and raped and by rockets and dildo rockets and miscellaneous torture sex items and such. So but anyway. Um again we do we do appreciate you calling in and uh you know, giving us the scoop. So we, we hope to hear from you again and uh well, we we hope that chastity belt keeps keeps holding up for you. Yeah, well, I hope I hope so. I uh, uh, thank you guys for having me on, and it's uh, good to talk with some, some fellow patriots that are concerned about me. Hmm. good. We are, and, and well, we hope it does. We hope it helps you as well. To you know, maybe talk and get it off your chest a little bit. It does. It does. It helps. That's good. That's good. Anytime, anytime, Conrad. We're gonna yeah, hopefully. Dude. We're gonna hopefully talk to you again here you real soon. You need anyone to, you know, to just sit down. You want to have a drink, whatever. Uh, so I think it was Jack Daniels you like. So just take a shot, you know. Call in and you know share, right. share uh, up. Give us the updates, you know. Let it all out, and uh, you know we're there for you. Right. Oh, good. Yeah, I can't drink Jack Daniels anymore. Baldy won't let me. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. well, and, and say okay. say hi to say hi to Baldy for everyone. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'll tell him I'll tell him I'll say hello. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thanks a All lot. All right, Conrad. Conrad. Well, again, yeah, thank you, sir. Yes. Thank you, guys. Have a good night. You too. Good Enjoy your same. evening, Conrad. <laughs> oh.